of ours as well. So keep it on your pass rush today. What's that? What was the key for your pass rush today? Oh, um, I think that it was kind of just a compounding effect of um, work that's been put in for a while now, as well as just the other D linemen like Craig and Brian Allen and Max and all those guys just doing their job and allowing me to come free. Uh, how important is it for you guys to get Brian going the way he's going, giving you another pass rusher? Yeah, I think it's very important. Um, Brian's a super hardworking guy, and uh, he's a nose for the football for sure. He can just find that thing. It's fun to watch. Max, same way? Oh, yeah. Max, I think, is like an energizer bunny. I mean, he's out there spinning around and running around, so he's, he's a lot of fun to watch as well. Do you guys have, like, a, a guy that yells or says stuff at halftime like, on the team? I would say it's more so just kind of we get in our groups and yeah. just talk to each other. It's not super rah rah, but yeah. I mean, we all know what's got to be done. So we just get together, talk about what happened in that first half and how we can kind of turn around. There's not much yelling going on. Yeah. What was Phil's message at halftime, and did he get animated? Phil Parker. Um, he was a little bit animated, not not too much. So I mean, he was mainly just saying, "Got to keep pounding, stay focused, and uh, eventually it'll break through for us." What are the emotions just in general after the 